They could say something so cool. They could also say nothing. They could just say, hey, Hyped for multi -car The Last of Us 2, Skyrim, and Assassin's Creed. See ya. That could totally happen, all right? But, <laughs> so, I'm still gonna get excited. Whoa! Whoa! You ever wonder, like, different choices? Does that Are mean backwards compatible? No. I like the hand we've been dealt. Why did I move here? I guess it was the weather. Oh! Or the, nah, I don't know, oh? that thing. That magic. <laughs> Get the I fuck out of here. trying to get out of this bullshit. Seven. Woo! I'm in. Hey, this looks pretty cool. You guys don't think this looks cool? You guys hate it? I hate it too. You you know what? That's a good point. It sucks. Garfield? Yeah. Excuse me. Whoa. It's a cat game. I'll play that. That sounds pretty cool. Yeah, that doesn't look that cool. If this was a movie, I'd be super hyped. Returnal? <laughs> All right, what's this? I'm not hyped. Fortnite 2? Didn't they already make that? Hey, it looks pretty lame, right? Looks pretty lame, right, everybody? It looks pretty cool, a little bit. A little bit cool, but not that cool. Man, you know what this reminds me of? Shadow Warrior. Is that what it's called? That game where you're that Asian guy that talks shit and cuts everyone in half? That's, this reminds me of that. Hmm. It doesn't look that cool. I wonder if it's gonna be in VR. That's pretty disappointing. I was looking forward to that game. Huh? Hey, this looks like a pretty cool kids game. I like this one. Hey, write this one down. I like this one. Maybe this is Elden Ring? were true. That looked interesting. Chris? Sorry, Ethan. Why? All right. I always knew Chris was a little cocksucker. Oh, man, that looks cool. Damn, Demon Souls and then that. And sprinkle on a couple others. Gran Turismo and whatnot. I said I wanted a dream scenario, Demon Souls and Resident Evil 8, and I got it. Dreams come true. Is it over? Milk tea? Damn, I haven't had a milk tea in forever. Let me get one of those. Get some of those bobas. Damn, this is some Discovery Zone shit. Makes you want to jump in. Oh, 
what's the console's reveal? <laughs> Thank you. Those are the curtains. They're moving over the meat curtains. Whoa. Whoa. Unexpected. That's not an that's a weird design. It's it's not flat. So you can't stack it. But that might not be a bad thing. It looks aerodynamic for when you reach top speed <laughs> of gaming, of course. It's got a splitter and, you know, it's got nice air inlets for downforce. All right, I guess so. I'm glad it has a disc drive. Oh, it's textured. All right, it's textured. <laughs> Thank you. Huh? I won't get one? Oh, there's another one without a disc. Digital edition. Whoa. Two versions. How much is it? Two versions. One's digital. Charging station. HD camera, oh boy. Oh boy. How much is it? We hope you've enjoyed the first glimpse of our future today. They didn't say. You've seen our most striking console design yet. And you've seen games that can only be enjoyed with the full range of PlayStation 5's features and power. At PlayStation, we believe in generational transitions, and we put years of work into making them happen. We want you to enjoy the unique benefits of moving from one generation to the next. Thank you for joining us. We're launching later this year, and we have tons more to share. Welcome to PlayStation 5. That was way, way way better than any gaming show any e3 any anything they've ever done that was way better because it didn't have a host it didn't have a bunch of fucking influencers sitting around uh you know sending you over to carol who's live at the fucking press release it didn't have any of that fast next one this game sucks this game sucks next game this game's trash next game I loved it. I will be ready. I loved it. That's the way to do it. Get rid of those hosts. Get rid of all those polls, all those fan interactions, any of that shit. Get rid of all of it. Do it like this every time. Standing ovation. I'm in. Thank you. Best presentation. Easy. Easy. Ever. And it's one good thing that came out of all this coronavirus shit. You know, when you get these fucking guys together live on stage, all they do is fucking make mistakes and sound nervous. And it always makes them sound like they're up to something. This was perfect. Resident Evil 8 and Demon's Souls are the ones that are really grabbing my cooch right now. And I also like Gran Turismo and a couple others. Whoa! The Tower Knight! That is so cool. Oh, that looked cool too. The biggest disappointment was Tokyo Ghostwire. That shit looks whack. For me, the biggest disappointment was Tokyo Ghostwire. And of course, <laughs> Demon you. Souls and RE8 are the super hype. Woo, that's the Dragon God! You know what? That what really gets me hype about Demon Souls? is it doesn't look like Dark Souls 3 or Bloodborne. 
which is probably because it's not made by FromSoft. I'm so happy for you, Dad. That's tight. I like that it doesn't look like Dark Souls 3 and Bloodborne. That's awesome. No, FromSoft isn't making it. Didn't you see the trailer? At the end of it, they talk about Bluepoint, right? Bluepoint are the guys who remade Shadow of the Colossus, which is a good thing because Shadow of the Colossus, the remake, is really close to the original. Get up in there, it's really you? close. You're pretty cool, too. That was awesome. That was awesome. That presentation was way better than anything they've ever done. Literally better than all of the Nintendo Directs, any of those. Because the host always ends up sounding so disingenuous. He's always like, oh, I'm so excited for this game and then let's see it. And then he forgets the name of the game or whatever. Or it's like some edgy cocksucker that's going to say something, <laughs> that like cur a curse word <laughs> that's going to feel like forced, you know, to connect with the youth. Mm, nah, this was way better. I loved it. What do you think about the console? I think, whatever. It's weird that it's not stackable. It seems inconvenient. Like if I were to have it right at this moment, I'd have to think about where I'd put it because of the way it's like a trophy. It seems like it's shaped like a karate trophy or something. It's got like a stand and a design, you know? First place <laughs> karate champion. Thank you. Well, I don't know. It looks like a router. Yeah, I guess it does kind of have a router look to it a little bit. I'm not in love with the design, but who gives a fuck? I mean, I'd like it to look a little cooler, I guess. Removable stand? Well, how's it going to stand up without the stand? You can't go on its side. Maybe it lays on its back. Yeah, and how much is it? It's nice that there's a digital version, but I think I would rather go for the, the one that has a CD player so that it could break right away and I could be pissed. I think I'll go with the CD player. Thank you. There's a picture of it laying flat. Oh, I didn't see that. The corners look fragile. Yeah, I mean, you won't be able to bite into it. That's true. Looks like it could be delicious. I don't know, I'm not in love with the design, but I did like the presentation. And I loved Man, that, do you remember what I said? I said a dream scenario would be a Resident Evil game that looks cool, doesn't matter what it is, and a Demon Souls remake. I got both of those things, and I got some Gran Turismo sprinkled on top, and a bunch of other things that I don't remember, but seemed decent. I'm in. The cat game, yeah, Hitman, yeah. Spider-Man, sure. Uh, what was that other one? There was one like like uh like a scary game about aliens and reliving the same day over again that one looked kind of shitty but i'll play it and then there was that bug snacks and that one um remember that one that was like a kid's game oh odd world what was that one that was like a kid's game oh that that also returnal or re whatever it was called there are a few decent ones Oh yeah, Ratchet and Clank as well. That was awesome. What a cool day. All right, chat room. Let's wrap this puppy up. You guys enjoy your big dinners and, you know, try and have a good one, will you? Lots of fun stuff to be excited about. So cool. Thanks for joining me, chat. See you in the sewer. Will you?